What's the crack, lads? It is that time again. What's coming a Thursday? Now, we're not going to be getting a huge update tomorrow. We will be getting player of the week, and it is going to be national teams. And we already know what players that we're going to be getting. So we had this tease from Konami, always on their Twitter. But we kind of know what we're going to be getting, right? So this is the original, and this is what we're going to be getting. Haaland, Isaac, and of course, Cristiano. Now, I'm going to do a video on Cristiano. I did a video on my last one where I had about his pack here that was going to be coming or that could potentially come which was the BBC pack or the Benzema, Ronaldo and Bale pack. A lot of people are saying, oh, this Ronaldo card can't come. Ronaldo can't have special cards because of the ties to UFL. I'm going to do a video on that and answer a couple of questions because the amount of misinformation around some of the topics out there at the moment. And I'm seeing a load of stuff about Master League as well that I'm not even going to get into. But we will see a new Ronaldo card that looks like here. And then that's obviously going to be his bicycle uh, kick. I'm not too, was it Poland they were playing, I think? Haaland Hattrick as well. And then Isaac as well. Now, there will be more players in this pack as well. But also, I think with this, you know, when we're getting kind of close now to the next big update, we are going to be getting this update here. Um, obviously, we're going to continue with the events and whatever. But the next big update that's going to be coming in terms of, well, it's not really the big update is, is coming in December. But the next one is actually going to be coming in um, December 5th, I think is the date that we're looking at here, right? Now, there's a couple of reasons why I think that that is the date. Most, most specifically, it is because usually the big updates, right? So the way Konami are doing it now at the moment, it seems to be that they have a content update and then they have kind of like a gameplay uh, or a kind of like a big switch up update, right? So you can see here that with these cards here, they're all seven days, right? So there's a week left in those and they will be tied obviously to the, to, um, to the other kind of like the match pass and stuff like that. Uh, not the match pass, but they're always kind of recycled, you know, every two weeks. But these selection draws here are kind of our biggest kind of uh, kind of like um, way of seeing what is going to be happening, right? So there's 21 days left in this, which is roughly three weeks. You know, that's what we're going to be getting uh, as of right now. So three weeks is going to bring us right up until the 5th of December. And obviously these are going to be gone as well. Usually they drop the nominating contracts and all the content a week before the big update. So it is interesting to see what they're going to do. And then that's obviously tied to the match pass as well. Um, but yeah, I mean, as of right now, lads, there isn't really much going on it with the game. I mean, I don't know your thoughts on it. The match pass you can see there is ending on the 5th to the 12th as well. So we don't really need to guess when the next big update is going to be coming. What we also do need to talk about, though, is what exactly is going to be included in this update, right? So we do know that first thing that we're going to be getting is these players uh, with 4.2, right? These are going to be scheduled for December 2024. And Konami usually like to do an early doors December uh, update. So I do think that the December 5th update will be the one. And we know that some players and managers are going to be recycled or else going to be removed. So for example, we might get a fake Jurgen Klopp as like a free agent manager, but Zeitzler will be taken out of the game. Benzema, Iniesta, all their standard cards will be gone as well, right? So, yeah, I do feel as if, like, right now, the game is probably at its... It's just at that point in the game, lads, as well, where it's that time of the year, you know, there's so many games coming out. I think Konami are lucky at the moment that UFL and a couple of other games aren't out and that they're not free to play. And also, EAFC seems to be, from everyone I'm, I'm, I'm watching, EAFC seems to be kind of going through a similar thing where... You know, a lot of people are just not enjoying the game at the moment. E you know, and EAFC have huge content. I think at this stage, man, it it's just a case of um, of waiting and seeing. But let me know what you guys think. As I said, I'm just keeping you up to date with the Player of the Weeks. And then next week, we will have all the nominating contracts. Obviously, on Monday, we'll have New Legends. We'll know about that as well. And we will be streaming on Thursday as well. Until then, don't forget to subscribe. I'll talk to you in a bit.